We are not responsible for any damages that may occur to your scene as a result of attempting these powerful Blender features. Hello! Have you ever wanted to delete the default cube in Blender in a much more complicated way than pressing X and delete? Of course not, but I don't care. Today, Makachek and I have two different methods on how you guys can delete the default cube in Blender without needing to press the X key. But rather, you'll be pressing even more keys. Before we get started, this tutorial will require you to at least have 20 years of experience in Blender. Now you're going to want to open Blender and not press the X button, which I know is super hard to do. Go down and click the square icon on the bottom left of your window and change the editor type window to the Python console. From there, you want to type in the following line of code bpy.ops.object.delete close parentheses. Make sure to include these parentheses at the end or this won't work, as well as have your object selected, at least for this method. What this does is this basically makes your blender do a bunch of stuff, and click the enter key and your cube should now go poof. Nah, but in all seriousness, uh, what this basically does is we've created a small line of code for Blender to run in order to delete our selected object. BPY is the module Blender goes off of. To use the operator in Blender, you would need to type in bpy.ops. And then from there, object.delete at the end is the command that Blender will use to execute. Now 0.1% of you guys are probably wondering, gee, this tutorial was really short. Aren't Blender tutorials usually a lot longer? Yes. So that's why we have the second method for you guys on how to delete the default cube. Hey, so I hear you want to eradicate the default cube. 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 Don't we all? Well, I'll show you a Python command that'll root out that sharp edged pest even if your scene is full of other objects. Just open a console window and type bpy.data.objects.remove. This will call the remove function. And then as the function's parameter, type bpy.data.objects, and then in square brackets, double quote, capital, cube. I assure you, there's no escape from this one. The cube doesn't even have to be visible. Now, just press enter. It, uh, it may take a moment. Uh, don't worry, it'll work. Uh-oh. What's this? Now I know about 2 million of you guys have been looking for a tutorial just like this, and this tutorial basically saved all of you guys' lives and changed your guys' life. So that's why I'm going to ask you to leave a like on this video so that more people can find this video. Be sure to also check out Micah Chuck's channel. I'll leave the description, uh, I'll leave the link to his channel in the description below. And until the next tutorial. <coughs> yeah, and thanks for watching.